Imaging antibodies in 3D reveals novel insights, unobtainable with other technology. We use clarity tissue clearing to render opaque tissues transparent. Once tissues are transparent, they can be immunostained and imaged. Clarity employs tissue lipid clearing prior to immunostaining. We have found that the workflow matters. Clear, stain, image. This prescribed order of operations produces superior results. ClearLight's 3D immunohistochemistry uses antibodies to highlight and identify antigens within a tissue sample. After tissue clearing, multiplex immunostaining is performed. A multiplex is three biomarkers and a nuclear counterstain. As an example, here we look at a mouse kidney immunostained with alpha-smooth muscle actin, seen in red. You can also see CD31 in green, which is used to highlight vascular endothelial cells, and DAPI, shown in blue, is our nuclear counterstain. In another example, this is an image of a human metastatic lymph node associated with a stage 2A non-small cell lung cancer adenosquamous tumor. Pancadherin, a cell adhesion marker, was used to observe tumor cells, while CD8 denoted the cytotoxic T cells, and alpha-smooth muscle actin was used as a marker for the stromal cells. DAPI was used as a nuclear counterstain. ClearLight has many optimized antibodies ready to use in your research. If you don't see your antibody of interest on our published list, we would love to talk with you. A small antibody feasibility study to test your antibody and tissue type with our methodology may be the next step. ClearLight has developed expertise in antibody penetration of thick tissues. Improving the penetration rate of antibodies into thick tissues increases our ability to visualize cellular and subcellular structure. Our methodologies can achieve high signal-to-noise ratios, enabling researchers to see more biology. As an example, this mouse xenograft was immunostained using pan-cytokeratin, pan-CK. With clarity, we maintained a strong pan-CK signal along with DAPI signaling, this is very apparent in the 2D slice view. Researchers should not have to make concessions while exploring the tissue microenvironment. You should be able to see both your biomarker of interest and your contrasting DAPI nuclear counterstain. The contrast helps confirm that you're actually seeing a true signal. When you choose 3D IHC for your research, it is important to find the right antibody and the right protocol that will address the questions you have. It all comes down to expression. A given antibody must express your tissue sample with the signal strength and precision to present meaningful scientific results. The order of clearing, staining, imaging matters. To achieve the best results for clearing, antibody penetration, and imaging, we encourage you to leverage ClearLight's expertise and intellectual property.